हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू सुरेश अग्रवाल्स मैथमेटिक्स शॉर्टकट्स सम मल्टीप्लिकेशन ट्रिक्स आर रियली वेरी 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 अमेजिंग एंड इफ यू प्रैक्टिस देम योर स्पीड ऑफ कैलकुलेशंस इन जनरल एंड मल्टीप्लिकेशंस इन पर्टिकुलर विल बी रियली क्विक एंड इफ यू कैन डू सम ऑफ दी कैलकुलेशंस ओरली और मेंटली इन योर माइंड देन the mathematical aptitude develops and you are among top 1% students who can actually solve problems mentally so what's the complete video i have four different short tricks for you in this video through which you will be able to multiply big numbers very very quickly and accurately and if you have not yet subscribed the channel please click the subscribe button here and along with that you have the bell shaped icon press that if you want to get all the notifications of future uploads of of uh, you know super quick calculation tricks on your mobile phone right so let's get on with the video and see the first multiplication trick so for the first trick i am going to take up a problem where i am taking a four digit number like 6528 and i will multiply it by a repeating number like 5555 now This number six five two eight. If I am able to multiply it by five and then by one 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 one, doesn't make a difference, right? Multiplication by five is easy. How? This is mental maths. You don't have to write it. I am writing it to explain it to you. So six five two eight. Put a zero and take half of this number. What is half of this number? Three. I write it here. See three, then two. Then twelve means six and a forty four zero. And now I need to multiply this by this number one 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 to get my answer. For multiplying by repeated ones, start from this zero. Then zero plus four four. Then take three digits. This is ten. And then take four digits. This is twelve. And then start with four and take four digits. This is fifteen. And then first three digits, which is eight plus three, eleven. First two digits is five, and finally the first digit is three. Now start from here: zero, four, ten means zero, one carry. Thirteen means three, one carry. Sixteen means six, one carry. Twelve means two, one carry. Six and a three. Now pick up the calculators: three six two six. Three zero four zero is the product of these two big numbers. It will never be wrong, okay? <laughs> right. This is the first trick. Now the second trick. Very very interesting. Watch this. Let's do eight hundred and thirty two, and I will multiply it by eight hundred and thirty eight. Now these are two special numbers. You know why? Because if you see the unit digits, they add up to ten. Two plus eight, ten. And the remaining part, eighty-three, eighty-three, is exactly the same. So whenever you have this criteria being followed by the numbers, what do you have to do? Take eighty-three and multiply it by the consecutive number eighty-four, and then multiply the unit digits two into eight. How do you multiply eighty-three and eighty-four? I will go for the vertically and crosswise method. This is twelve, so two, one carry. Thirty-two and twenty-four. Thirty-two and twenty-four is fifty-six plus one fifty-seven, so seven. And a five carry. Eight eights are sixty-four and five sixty-nine, so six nine seven two. And two eights are sixteen. Just right here. And now, what do you have to do? Pick up the calculators and check six nine seven two one six. Is it the product of these two three-digit numbers? Again, you are going to be. You know, you got to appreciate also. Okay. So comment here whether you are liking these all uh, or not. Okay, let's see another one. The third trick. Now suppose you have a number like eight hundred and eighty-four, which is little away from one thousand, and I need to multiply it by a number which is near to one thousand, like nine hundred and eighty-eight. So if I can find out how much is this number away from thousand, so thousand minus eight eighty-four, I know is how much? One hundred and sixteen. And thousand minus nine eighty eight is just twelve, right? If I can multiply these two numbers, it will be amazing for me. And for the rest of the answer, 
I've just tried 884 and 988, one below the other, the two numbers. And let's have the product. 12 6 are 72. So 7, 12 ones are 12 plus 7, 19, 9, 1 carry and 13. 1392. I put a slash here. Now either subtract like this or subtract like this. You will find that the difference is same. 884 minus 12 is easier, right? So this is 872. Wow. I have my answer now. Because they are close to 1000, I will take 3 digits from here. 392. And this one I will carry forward. And this 872 becomes 873. So again, you can pick up the calculators. 873392 is the answer. Likewise, suppose you have big numbers like 7, 2, 2, 8, 6, I can take any big number. I am taking a 5 digit number for the reference, but I am sure you can work it out for 10 digit numbers also. Suppose you don't know 13 times table and still I want to multiply it by 13. You know 3 times table at least, right? So what do I have to do? Watch. <clears throat> 6, 3 times is 18, so I will write 18 here. 8 3 times is 24, add the next number, 24 plus 6 is 30, so I will write 30, 2 3 times is 6, add 8, 6 plus 8 14, 2 3 times is 6 plus add 2 8 and finally 7 3 times is 21 plus next number 2 is 23 and write the first digit as it is here and now do the same thing. Retain the unit digit, carry forward that uh, 1. So 31 means 1, 3 carry, 17, 7 means 1 carry, 9, and then 23 means 3, 2 carry, and then we have the 9. 9, 3, 9, 7, 1, 8. What do you have to do? Check using the calculator and try. You know, you got to try 20, 20 types. 2020 questions of each type okay so that you can feel comfortable and you will be doing it yourself and implement this when you have practiced enough okay that is very important do uh, let me know in the comments below whether you like the video or not and if you did do share it with all your friends that will be a big big motivation all the best for your practice